exposing the truth, Mayigan General's vendetta against Sunday Ademo Igboho. In recent times, there has been a wave of misinformation and baseless accusations aimed at tarnishing the reputation of Sunday Ademo Igboho, a prominent Yoruba rights activist. One of the key figures behind these attacks is none other than Mayigan General, who appears to have a personal vendetta against Igboho. Today, we will delve into why Mayigan General is on this crusade and debunk the false claims linking Igboho to the upcoming nationwide protests, the real reason behind the smear campaign. Mayigan General's animosity towards Sunday Adeyemo Igboho can be traced back to a specific incident. Igboho, known for his integrity and commitment to the Yoruba Nation cause, stopped Mayigan General from raising funds in his name. This decision was made to prevent the misuse of funds and ensure that the resources were used appropriately for the cause of the Yoruba people. Mayigan General, feeling slighted and exposed, has since embarked on a mission to discredit Igboho. False claims and misinformation. In an attempt to smear Igboho's name, Mayigan General has been spreading false information, alleging that Igboho is involved in the upcoming nationwide protests. These claims are completely unfounded. Igboho has categorically stated that he has nothing to do with these protests. His focus remains steadfast on advocating for the rights and freedom of the Yoruba people, and he has not endorsed or planned any such demonstrations. The truth about Igboho's pardon and Mayagan General's role. Mayagan General's narrative also includes misleading information about Igboho's pardon by the government of Benin and his subsequent freedom to travel to Germany and return to Nigeria at will. This is being spun to suggest that Igboho is somehow in cahoots with President Tinubu, dubbed Thief Nubu by his detractors, to intimidate opponents in the Southwest. This is far from the truth. Igboho's release and freedom are a result of international diplomatic efforts and not some clandestine deal with the Nigerian government. These accusations are merely a smokescreen used by Mayagan General to deflect attention from his own questionable actions. Exposing Mayagan General's true intentions. It is clear that Mayagan General's attacks on Igboho are driven by personal grievances and a desire to undermine his credibility. The Yoruba Nation movement has always been about unity, integrity, and the pursuit of justice. By trying to co-opt the movement for personal gain and then attacking those who expose him, Mayagan General is doing a disservice to the cause he claims to support. Conclusion, standing firm in truth. Sunday Adeyemo Igboho remains a steadfast advocate for the Yoruba Nation. Despite the false accusations and smear campaigns, his commitment to the cause has not wavered. It is essential for supporters and followers of the Yoruba Nation movement to see through the deceit and recognize the true motives behind these attacks. Uh, the upcoming protests have nothing to do with Igboho, and any attempt to link him to them is merely an effort to tarnish his reputation. As we move forward, let us stand united in truth and continue to support those who genuinely work for the betterment of the Yoruba people. Court restricts Lagos protests to designated parks. Let us know your thoughts on today's headlines in the comments below. Stay informed, stay engaged, and we'll see you in the next update. Have a great day.